Hi guys, today I'm showing you how to make orange and sweet potato cake. This cake is absolutely delicious and has some very healthy ingredients in there. To start, I've peeled my sweet potato, I've cut it into small pieces and I've boiled it for about 10 minutes just until it's tender. And now I've just mashed it into a bowl and then I'm gonna pop that on the side to cool while I do my other ingredients. Into a bowl, I've got some self-raising flour and I'm just going to sift that. And then into that, I'm going to add my baking powder. If you've got any lumps, just press that through with the back of your spoon. So that is all of the dry ingredients. Next in goes some chopped up apricots. These add such a nice flavour. And I'm just going to coat the apricots into the flour. This will help them from all spreading down to the bottom. Okay, and once they're all mixed in, we're just going to leave that bowl on the side. So once your sweet potatoes have cooled, it's time to add in your wet ingredients. So I have some olive oil. Give that a mix around. I'm just using a wooden spoon. Next in goes the honey. So I've just got some clear honey. Pull that in. I love the look of running honey. It's so pretty. Make sure you get everything from off the bowl and give that a mix in as well. So once that's all combined, I'm going to add in my three eggs. Just to make sure they all get combined, I'm going to beat them after each one. So I'm going to do it one at a time. Last one. Now that all of my eggs are mixed in, I'm going to finely zest the whole of this orange. And then once you've zested the orange, I'm just going to add two tablespoons of the juice. The smell of these oranges are so nice. I can't wait for the cake already. Preheat your oven to 140 degrees fan. For other temperatures, they'll be listed here. Now all that's left to do is add our wet ingredients into our dry ingredients. So I'm going to pour it in and give it a good stir. I just love the colour of this cake mix, it's so pretty. Once that's all combined, pour that into your tin lined with some baking paper. And once you've poured it all into your tin, just smooth it over with the back of your spoon. Make sure it's nice and flat. That then goes in the oven for about 45 minutes. So once your cake is out of the oven, you want to leave it to cool and then you can get on with the topping. So I've got some cream cheese in my bowl and then I'm going to add to that some honey. And then using my spoon, I'm just going to mix that all together. And to finish the topping, I'm just going to grate in the zest of one orange. And then just stir that all together. And that is the frosting done. So all that's left to do is to ice the cake. So I'm just going to spoon it on and then use my palette knife to smooth it over the top. I'm gonna make sure every bit gets a nice bit of frosting. So I'm going to cut it into some squares and enjoy. So that's orange and sweet potato cake, easy. And sugar free.